Dave again at Warrington Collegiate and we're with Justina from the public services team, is that yeah, correct? That's right, yeah. And um, so thank you very much for agreeing to be interviewed. And you're going to what, what innovative piece of technology are you using at the moment? Uh, we've been using Socrative um, for about a year now. Yeah. Um, and we've shared the knowledge within the team so that everybody in the team had to learn to do a quiz. Um, some people have used it like as a start of activity, as a plenary, um, to check on previous learning from the previous lesson. So there's one here that um, Hillary's done, and Hillary's new to our team. Where are we? Select a quiz. Start a quiz. Evidence collection. Um, and we don't want to disable student feedback. No. And we'll go with immediate feedback. So she set up a quiz here. Okay. With um, nine questions. Yes. Some of them are multiple choice. Okay. Uh, some of them are true and false. And some of them um, allow a more detailed response when you're okay. trying to dig in for a more separative answer and understand answers. Okay. Okay. Um, so it took about 20 minutes to run. They normally take about 20 minutes to run, depending on how many questions you put in. Okay. Make it as big or short as you need to. Um, let's have a look. So just tell us, Justina, how do learners access this learning? Right. They can either access it on a laptop, okay. a computer, or on the form. They can yes. download the form. Uh, they log in to your virtual classroom. So each teacher has their own virtual classroom number. Right. So ours are like either up on a PowerPoint or mine's up on a poster in my room so they know what Tina's virtual classroom is all sure. the time. So they log in there. And then I'll say, right, we're doing this quiz. So I have to make the quiz live for them to log into the virtual classroom. Okay. And then it'll show them all logging in. And then as we go through question by question, and you have it up on the smart board at the same time, you can see who's answering. Yes. And then you move on to the next question when all the students have answered. And you can stop it. And if you feel as if you want to have a discussion point on it because not everybody understands it, you can break into little discussions like that. Okay. And at the end, it will print all the answers out into an Excel spreadsheet so then you've got a record for formative assessment of who understands what different concepts. Okay, so you can see pretty much instantly who, who at what level students are working at and if you need to, set, set stretch and challenge or, yes. or go in with some support maybe if, if they're not grasping it, would that be right? Yeah, yeah. and that okay. can help you plan your lesson while you're in the middle of the lesson and re-engineer your groups accordingly or do it for next time if you're doing it near the end okay, of the Okay, well, this sounds really, really good. And uh, thank you to Nick the Geek, who's just uh, texted us up, says, excellent explanation. So would you say Warrington Collegiate is a college that encourages learners to bring their own devices? Yes, uh, yeah, definitely. If they've got it at home, because they're more familiar with how their own devices work rather than trying to get around the different laptops and the different... Um, iPads or uh, tablets that we've got in college. So if they're using their own devices, they already know the way around it, so they're usually quicker with that way. Um, and the way within public services, we usually try and bring it in within the induction week on like DAF quizzes, yeah, yeah. so that they get used to using these sort of quizzes. So when it comes into relevant things to topics and learning that they're doing, they become more familiar with how the quizzes work. Sure. Sure. Well, Justina from Public Services, thank you so much. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll catch you later and see what other innovative bits and bobs your team have, uh, have uh, developed. But that's a brilliant explanation. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. And, uh, we'll, uh, because you need people logging in, don't we? Yeah. So we needed Diane to log in. I'm still trying to log out. Like you see, we're still live, still um, looking at the stage and... In a few minutes, we'll be having colleagues coming back for a plenary, talking about the technology, people move, walking around with laptops, people walking around with phones. There's Nick, there you go. There's Nick feeding, feeding the, uh, the feed from Socrative back onto his own phone with a delay. So we'll catch you back in a few minutes, teaching technology at Warrington Collegiate.